Hi, this is Jessica here at the red carpet premiere at Arclight Hollywood of Morgan Spurlock's Comic-Con Episode 4, A Fan's Hope. I want to know what is the weirdest thing that they've ever overheard at a convention or a fan came up and told them. So let's go check out their answers. When this woman wanted me to autograph a certain part of her anatomy. Did you do it? No. <laughs> I was in an elevator with some guy who was in like a, uh, like a full body suit. I don't even remember what his costume was, but I heard him say to his friend, I heard him lean over and go like, I gotta go change my underwear. And I don't really know what that meant, but just to kind of catch that and think about it for myself was enough. Um, I did have a woman once, honestly, just one time, I, only once, which is a shame, uh, who said, would you mind signing my breast? Um, I had um, a gentleman ask to take a picture of my toes. So, uh, so yeah, I didn't, I, just, just, just a cleavage. It, was, it wasn't that, that gross, but and, uh, so I took a Sharpie and was like, <laughs> Did you oh, allow that? Yeah, it's like whatever, just take a picture. I mean, it's, you know, it's my toe, it's not like something else. But yeah, it was a little odd. You know, the weirdest thing about Comic-Con is the, the dichotomy of, you know, you're standing in line for a panel and in front of you is an entire family and they seem very well adjusted and behind you is a guy dressed as Wolverine, uh, deeply using his inhaler, uh, which is very out of character for Wolverine. He shouldn't have asthma. He should not have an uh, inhaler. And it's like seeing those moments, like watching someone with like a half-eaten plate of nachos, you know, dressed as poison ivy, kind of hunched over and just sadly putting them into their mouth. Like that's always my favorite part. It's not when everybody's bouncing around, it's when there's a stormtrooper at a urinal. That's the good stuff. Uh, I think it was the first Comic Con I went to and I found myself lost in in the um, the card gaming area and they were demoing this very complicated weird game and I think I said out loud, I was like, wow, this is crazy. And I literally had all these nerds like just kind of like stop what they're doing. It was like the record stop and like turn to us and like look at me like I was an alien. Like, what are you doing here? Uh, you know, I, I, I can't really answer that. I got to say, uh, uh, I don't really have a lot of odd interactions at Comic-Con. I mean, a lot of times I'm just meeting people and signing autographs and that kind of stuff and, and doing panels and everything. Uh, I get odd questions every now and then, but, uh, you know, for me, it's just a, it's an experience where I get to have a face-to-face -face interaction with my fans and, you know, have a conversation with them about the work and what they like about it and what they don't like about it and you know it's 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 a really you know it's a special moment for me so uh, odd not a lot of odd interactions unfortunately hey I'm Morgan Spurlock this is Doug Jones this is Crystal Al Candace Bailey OMG I'm Kevin Pereira I'm Riley Vanderbilt I'm Claire Grant and this is Girl Gamer and you're watching Girl Gamer you are watching Girl Gamer you're watching Girl Gamer oh, you're watching Girl Gamer they're watching you're they're watching right now right Girl Gamer hey Girl Gamer watcher Stop hitting on them. What? I'm, they could be, uh, yeah, okay. Go Gamer, what up?